What you want to do, Mr. Kobe Jonathan Porter, uh, Bryant, what you want to do is go ahead and repent today and start over, my that ain't it, okay? I'm going to tell you the truth this one last time. I'm going to give you one more last secret, okay? Because you done about used up all your biblical passes, baby. You done used them all up today. You, gonna, you, you want me to respect your wife? That's not a wife. That's a maid. You need to know the difference, okay? A wife is a can help me. It ain't a drunk, complaining, crying, weird, pumpkin head, crybaby. Okay, that's not a wife. You don't have a help make You got a maid. You getting them mixed up. Respect your wife. You pray my son go live because you want him to burn it. Kobe, huh? That's why you want it. That's why you want him to go live. You this bitch tell him don't share my show. Baby, I'm 51 years old. This ain't for me. I got about maybe 30, 40 good ones left in me. This is for Carter. This is for Jesus. This is for Avery. This is the people that I promised through my blood. So it looks like Blueface's mom, Carissa, is not a fan of his recent engagement to Jaden Alexis because she is doing her best to break up the engagement. Carissa is coming with everything she's got because she just exposed Blueface for proposing to Jaden because he wants her money Jaden just signed up. Major record deal and Carissa is saying that Blueface's master plan is to steal Jaden's money and destroy her. And listen, y'all are not going to believe the crazy teeth that Kalisa is trying to spell. You want me to respect your wife? That's not a wife. That's a maid. You need to know the difference. So in case I'll miss the drama that's been going on, Blueface just shocked the world when he randomly decided to propose. Now, Blueface and Jaden have been together since high school, and they even have two kids together, so you'd think that it's not all that surprising that he wanted to tie the nut and live happily ever after. Right. I mean, sure, he's had his fair share of cheating escapades and even had another child with someone else. But hey, he's still got his sights on marrying Jaden. So he proposed. But what really caught people off guard is that we kind of expected him to go for Shane, not Jaden. I mean, Blueface has been juggling both of them along with the other few ladies. I mean, it's been a crazy love triangle or Pentagon. But it seemed like he had a soft spot for Sean, yes, they had dramatic fights, hair pulling public messes and all that drama, but honestly, he didn't treat Jaden any better. And to add some extra spice to the drama, it's been just about three weeks since he and Jaden had a seriously messy Twitter showdown. Now this happened because he made up with Shan and Jaden didn't take it very well, and she felt like he betrayed her, but to make things even more complicated, Blueface S. Cran had broken up when she was pregnant because he threatened to hit her, and she decided that she had enough and wanted to protect her baby. A schoolyard crit bitch, look a killer in his eyes. Like, you don't think I'll kill you and kick you in your stomach and you'll be bleeding for months? Like, did he took my phone, make sure I wasn't recording and none of that? Like, all right, long story short, right? I try to get up. He like make one more step to the door. I'm up. Like, yo was like psychopathically weird. Like, but she and Blueface made up after she had the baby. And he even flew into Baltimore to see her and meet the baby for the first time. She even agreed to appear in the music video for his song Baby Mama Drama. Well, when Jaden found out on social media like the rest of us, this sent her into a downward spiral, causing her to flip out on him on Twitter. She said a gas station is crazy, a deadbeat, and shooting a music video or in the studio for fun is different. But y'all go off, I know y'all need the clout. She also announced her exit from his label, saying, I'm sorry to all the fans, I'm not with Mill Music, no longer I do not condone bullying, and anything on his page is no longer my consent, Blueface then said I. Just want my kids to be good. These girls have grown already. I tried to help people and they always turn on me. 
I sign both my baby mamas, I guess I'm the problem. He also said, I don't know how to be a deadbeat dad. I'm sorry I can't live up to you guys' bad dad expectation. But he didn't stop there. Because he went on to say that Jaden never believed in him when he decided to be a rapper. That was his reason that he never was going to marry her. He tweeted, when I first started rapping, Jaden didn't support me or my music. That's why I never really took her seriously when I got on one day I was in the studio and she told me I would never be nippy or p diddy. It was motivating to prove her wrong. That's the reason I ain't marry her. He continued, you went from the good girl to a regular girl that fast. Shaking my head, sorry I couldn't say F my son for you. I can't believe you would expect that of me knowing the role I play in my kid's life. If any female make me choose between them and my kids, they might as well. Oh, so, but I've always cheated and I'm fully aware and accountable for the role I played in these females' lives. I'm definitely a part of the problem, but dang, I will just be trying to put them on for real Jaden. Then tweeted my baby daddy and op sorry to disappoint all he's a narcissist, a liar. And a weirdo so blue face and Jaden were on the out. But he didn't mind because he and Shan were still good. He defended Shan every time fans came for her parenting or called her a bad mom, like when she got done. Ragged for taking the baby to Walmart and not even supporting his little head, not only did Blueface end to drag her, but he also asked fans to stop coming for her parenting, saying, I know she going through something and it's not easy. No hood harder than parenthood. So I'm not going to be mean to her, no. More, because her mental state determines how my son's day goes. Let's just encourage her to be more accountable and responsible this time around. Come on, Rock, we got this, I'm here, so if he was going to pop t He questioned we would expect it to be chissin' like really, but things took a crazy left turn when he posted a picture of their baby's privates on social media to shame her for being a bad mom. It was a disgusting situation, and he immediately switched sides to Jaden and went back to draging Cran, he even. Helped her write a song, Barbie, where she shaded Shan, saying, I'm a wife, you would try be this, my D can keep him with a then? You should have asked me. I'm in the front row now. Sis, take the back seat, cleat. And you can't pass me. I'm in the front now. But even though he and Jaden were back on good terms, nobody really saw this proposal coming. I mean, it's Blueface we're talking about here, and commitment isn't exactly his strong suit besides, but it's only been three weeks since he said he would never. Mary Jaden, so what in the world just changed in a short time now? We all thought that it might be because Chris Seen seemed to be moving on, because in case you missed it, she's got her a new man, Chainska. T, a man, and listen, she kind of dropped a hint when she posted a FaceTime screenshot with a guy caption, who else loves a man with dimples and tats? So yeah, we all thought that Chrome was moving on with the new man causing Blueface to go wild with jealousy, and he tried to one-up her by making Jaden his fiance, but according to his mom, Carissa Cran had nothing to do with it at all, because Blueface had some more sinister plans than that. Now we all know that Carissa does not like Jaden at all, and she often throws shade at Jaden whenever she gets a chance to do so. For example, when Blueface shaded Carissa for mistakenly posting a picture of her butt, Carissa hit back, with now I said it was an accident, but it looks better than the one you spent your life savings on not Jaden and her her BBL catch it. Astray well, when Blueface's proposal went viral, Kalisa did not congratulate them at all. Instead, she threw some major shad saying, did this ninja propose to the maid? Oh well, it's October now, tell the people yeah. Who marry the ma just in case you go to prison? Yeah, let's just say that Carissa is not exactly thrilled to have Jaden as a new daughter-in-law, but y'all this made Blueface so mad that he went on a rant against his own mom saying, post your ring, and I'm a post mine you want to compare booties right. Carissa, let's compare rings. Let's see what type of ring that old booty got and what type of ring that new booty got my wife going to always win Carissa. Married a bum after all them D she took she settled fa. Or that little ring my wife had one D her whole life. He also said my mother is a been married three times three kids by three different men and never married. None of them men, only random men she like with a lot of money so she could divorce and take from them. And at the end of it all, she's Sleeping with a bum every night sad story for real could never respect her as a woman my mom's ring is one carat with five stones surrounding it. I'm not even gonna tell y'all Jaden ring credentials it's going. And to be embarrassing for real, the comparison is evident if you got more than one baby daddy as a woman you're a. It's that simple life is like a box of D-pick one and go wall. Well.
It's the disrespect and audacity for me as if he don't got two baby M himself. But anyways, Carissa was determined to get her lick back because from the looks of it, she's trying to break them up. She's now claiming that the real reason Blueface proposed is that he is trying to control Jaden's money in case I'll missed it, Jade. And recently signed a Columbia.